welcome back to my channel and today I will be showing you my room tour and I'm very excited. Make sure to go back and watch my video on how this room came about because I remodeled the entire thing. I changed the flooring, changed the wall color. It looks totally different. So go check that video out before you watch this one and let's get into the video. Here is my bedroom door and when you open it, the first thing that you see is my bed. This is from Arizona Rug Company. I will have everything linked in the description that I can find online. Here is just kind of a overview, just so you can kind of get your bearings of where everything is. First thing when you walk in on the left is just my closet doors. And I will show you guys what's in here. It's pretty organized um, and I have a lot of shoes, but that's what that looks like. And then on the other side, I have everything just hanging over here. So that's that. And then moving on to my little nightstand. This is from Living Spaces. My lamp is from Target. This little candle is amazing. It's like my favorite scent. Um, I like don't use it too often because I'm trying to like save it because I never want to run out because I think they don't make this anymore in anthropology. My little candle holder. I want to say home goods. My little Polaroid with Dakota. Super cute. And it's a little snow globe from Urban Outfitters. And then this plant is from Home Goods as well. And I love it. And then my coaster is from Anthropology. This granite tray is from Home Goods as well. It's very heavy duty and it's really good quality. And I think it looks really good here because it ties in with my desk because my desk and my dresser are both white. So that kind of ties that in. Here is the first drawer. And I just have a bunch of candles, some of my remotes, a book, my retainer, my glasses. And then this one is where I keep like all of my journals. And like this thing is literally filled with, oh, that's like a little tin I used to keep stuff in in college. Um, just like notebooks, journals, not all of them were like full or anything, but just little knickknacky stuff. And then just some pens back there, stickers. I love stickers, you guys. Moving back to my bed, my bed is also from Living Spaces. My pillows, the two white ones are from Pier One. All of these are from Home Goods. And then this little panda, I call him Panda Baby because Dakota got him for me. And I'm, I love him, he's so cute. And then this blanket is from Home Goods. And my duvet cover is actually from West Elm, but I got it on sale. It was only like $40. And I had this in college, but I brought it home. I really liked it and it went with my theme still. So moving on to the photo that's above my bed, I actually made this on PicMonkey. I was inspired by one that I saw on Etsy, but I actually wanted to make it faster. Um, to film this video so I made it myself and then got it printed out at Staples and it only ended up being like $20 So that was a steal and then the frame is from Walmart so This was a very cost-effective little DIY and it turned out really cute And I think it ties everything in nicely and I love looking at that every day and it's just a nice reminder Moving over to the right side of the bed I have this cute little hamper and it kind of matches my pillow It is also from the world market and It's really nice because it has handles so you can carry it to the laundry room You don't have to like lug the whole thing you can just use the handles so moving over to this side i have this great shelf from ikea and i was inspired by tana montana because she had this in her house and i was literally in love with it so i've kind of styled it not very well but it's good enough for right now i just have this hat on top that is from urban outfitters um it's pretty old but i wanted to repurpose it and use it on here over here, I have this print, and I got this in Kauai this summer on my family trip, and I'm in love with it. She's actually a local artist on Oahu, which I've also been to. It just really reminded me of the trip. I'm like obsessed with Kauai, so I love that. I have this photo of me in Dakota that's really cute, a Chanel perfume, and this awesome pink rock stone thing from Home Goods, and I love it, and I just have a fake little candle in there. Here is a close-up on that super cute and then moving down is a terrarium that dakota got me and he got it for my birthday last year and i absolutely love it so i had to put that in here and then under that i just have a big glass like bowl thing it's actually empty for right now but i might just like throw some sunglasses in it or something for a little storage but otherwise it's just pretty like decorative and then i have my nylon magazines which you guys know i'm obsessed with um, I just have a couple out and then I have my Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen book which is super cool and that is the shelf 
And then moving over, I just have this bin. I just needed a place to put all of my camera stuff, a bunch of old cameras, cords, all that good stuff, headphones, and then back there, I have this adhesive for a DIY project that I'm gonna do with my desk. Um, and then I just have a bag back there. Here is my white desk that I told you guys that I revamped in my uh, redoing my room vlog and it turned out really good. I think it looks pretty nice. My chairs from Amazon and my little trash cans from Target. I haven't totally like styled my desk yet. Um, I don't really wanna keep the perfumes there. I just didn't really know where else to put them. I'm gonna get a new lamp. This really cute boss sign though is adorable and I'm obsessed with it. And that's from Home Goods. And I love this cup, it's super cute. It's from the nylon shop. I got this from Ross like a bunch of years ago and I just loved it still. And then this one is from Anthro and just like a plain little organizer here. Um, and then I also have some books back here. And then I have a bunch of flowers that Dakota's given me over the past like year. Um, so that is it for this side. I have this really adorable little basket that I just got from Home Goods. They're so cute. I literally love these because they're so soft. So like putting my camera and stuff in there, it doesn't like stress me out. And then here is my mirror. Yes. It is from Home Goods. It's like the perfect um, corner stand up mirror. It just looks perfect and like really fills the space up nice. I just have my adorable little plant and I love it. It just adds a nice touch to the room. And this basket is from Amazon. On this side I have my dresser and my TV and this is from Living Spaces. In this corner I have just some cute little things. This lavender candle, shout out to Lauren. Thanks girl. Here's another candle, this glass little jar. This was from the world market a couple years ago and this was from home goods and then i got this really cute sign dakota and i got it in toronto and we figured that we would take it with us like wherever we go and wherever we live someday and we both just really liked the saying so we got that i just need to get it framed i just can't decide if i want to get a black or a white frame so i'm still deciding on that here is just my tv over here, I just have a little bowl. I normally keep my keys, sunglasses, chapstick, things that I'm just like grabbing on the go. Over here is just my jewelry holder. I love the mix of wood, it just makes it look a lot nicer. And I have to show you guys because Dakota actually got me this necklace for Christmas last year. I don't wanna drop that one. I think it is like the most beautiful necklace ever. On the back of my door, I just have my purses. This is the one that I use all the time, just the black Rebecca Minkoff Mini. Um, and I just actually got this black padded leather one. That is it for my room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to check the down bar for all the products that I can find that'll be linked down below. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Oh,